changing spark plugs today. So the first thing I'm gonna do is take this off the relay box um, and move it away. The relay box off and put it on the side. Now I am going to unhook these four spark plugs. Basically, I just did one. You click on this and then you just wiggle it out. So that's it. Time pulling this one off. So I use my tweezers to put it down here and then you can push it through. Last one is extremely hard to get to. So I really suggest get tweezers and you have to push it down. Ah. Uh, I can't hold my phone and show, but basically get tweezers. The last one out, let's see, right here. I mean, can you see that I got it out? But it was really hard, get a tweezer. So I've disconnected all of them and uh, do get this. It will help tremendously, get tweezers. It has to be like thin. And okay, so now I have to use 10 millimeter to get these four. These screws off. I took the screws off, so now I have to pull these out. Slowly. Okay. Looks okay out one and I'm going to replace one at a time so now I have a magnetic socket and I felt it catch the spark plug and so now I'm gonna screw it baker bar here so this is how it's gonna go and then in is just like unscrewing this the spark plug here and let's see the condition it's in not bad just rusty okay so i'm gonna replace it with a new one. okay so yeah the old one looks really old i already measured this so it's so super important not to get this cross threaded so just go gently like that and then you're gonna tighten it to 13 foot pounds the manual so 156 inch pounds which is 13 snug so that is from the manual and those are the the type of that you need to use those to 10 see 10 and then you're gonna add three more so that's gonna be 13 so that's the torque wrench 